This is a full guide on how to get Packer Punch on Terminus on Black Ops 6. Alright, the first thing that you need to do when you exit the room, there's a black box. Go ahead and press on that black box. And you're gonna have to defend it. And at the end of the timer, when you defend the box, you can go over to the next one. But keep in mind, zombies deal more damage to the box. So you're gonna have to keep an eye on it because there's if you're playing solo there's gonna be one of you and you're gonna have to keep a close eye on it and kill as much zombie as possible. Now after you get that box that first box done you can choose two routes. You want to choose the left one. Once you go into the left one you can you gotta shoot your way down to your second box your second box have you go down the stairs to your left you're gonna have to keep shooting so you don't get hit and you're not gonna get stuck or anything but you will need money to open these doors just like regular round base zombies now once you have enough money and once you kill enough zombies you can go into the next location will be down the stairs through you just gotta follow the arrows and you're gonna go through the doors and then there you will see your second box once you see your second box and if you don't have enough money then you're going to need to kill some more zombies and start that box and just keep in mind when you start that box because you're in solo you're gonna have to keep a close eye on it until the timer runs out when the timer runs out it's a good thing and you can go on to the third location now this location this second location is a little bit harder because zombies are closer to the box and you have to watch from far away and keep your eye on it and if you get overwhelmed it's okay you can throw a grenade over there it won't deal any damage to the box you just have to kill the zombies that are damaging it so you don't have to start all over and you can do this as many times as you can and also there's a little side easter egg if you shoot the pool table you get money for it so now once you go once you finish that second box you're gonna work your way out of the out of the building and then you're gonna have to kill a couple zombies to get some more money because there's a lot of doors you gotta open and you'll see another purple arrow but I chose well I chose the left to get ammo and since you saw in the, the in the gameplay you can go to your left and there will be a, a ammo cache straight ahead. Now, once you get out of that building, you're going to have to kill some more zombies because it's a thousand to do and it's 500 to start the box. So a thousand to open up a door, it's 500 to start the third box. Now you're going to have to open up a whole bunch of doors to get to this third thing. Now you want to go through the cage catwalk area. And once you go through the catwalk area, you're going to follow that purple arrow that goes down and you'll see a downstairs. You're going to follow that downstairs all the way to the downstairs until you reach a door where you have to blow up. Now, if you get stuck down there, it's okay to get back up to grab some more money. And once you grab enough money, you can, you know, you can open more doors because me in this, I struggled and... I didn't reach until round 10. It's better to open up and do those two first boxes and try to get enough money while you're doing your challenge. Now if you get stuck, you can go back up on top, run around, and whatnot. And whatnot. So you can run around, grab some more money, cash, whatever you need to do. There is salvage you can collect. There are zombies that will get you stuck down in the mines. That, but So you can run around. It's a safe place. But if you get overwhelmed, you might want to get out of that area. Now, there's that purple arrow that does, you know, it tells you where the third box is. 
and just keep in mind you might want to use your grenades like I said in the beginning of the video now if you guys enjoyed this video so far please leave a like and subscribe if you are new to this channel and so forth now right here as you're seeing there you gotta be aware there is a bug round in Black Ops 6 on Terminus. Now you can earn money by this, you know, you gotta keep watch out and it's better to be outside instead of in the caves because you have a little bit more room to run around and you can see the bugs more and so and you have a little bit more range and you can dodge left and right. So once you get enough money to open up the door you're gonna open up that door so once we open up this door right now you're gonna get your bubble gums so forth and whatnot now this is a hard part you're going when you activate it there's gonna be zombies coming out of the tubes and there's gonna be zombies running out of there and if you get stuck throw your grenades your grenades and your field upgrades are your allies so Keep in mind, it's a little bit harder because there's new um, zombies, there's spiders, there's flying bugs, and zombies climb up everywhere on the location thing. And once that timer is done, and you're all you're almost there to get your packer punch. And once all that is done, power is on. Now, there's there is a purple mark. Uh, not a purple an orange mark sorry I get mixed up with my purple and my orange when I play games so bear with me here but once that orange marker pops up and you're gonna have to go into water once you go in, jump into water you, you can activate the your packer punch and then the the platform will rise up lock in place and you can use your packer punch once you get 5,000 now you can't stay in water too long or a green gas monster will come and get you that's like a worm thing but I hope you guys enjoyed this video of an easy guide to get your packer punch on black ops 6 zombies on terminus now thank you guys for so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one